Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am not feeling the greatest today, so I apologize if I'm like a little off today. That would be why, um, but I really wanted to film this video for you guys. Like I said in my last video, I haven't been very consistent with my filming or my uploading, so I'm trying to like get on top of it. Um, and I got super excited today because, <clears throat> as you can obviously tell from today's video, my Jeffree Star Cosmetics uh, mystery box showed up today. So I bought the deluxe one, which I think was like $70 or something like that. So yeah, it's $175 worth of product for $70. So it comes with 10 items. And it comes with the exclusive liquid lipstick shade that is only in this box and the premium box and it's not going to be made again. So I am super excited to dig in here and see what came in here. All right. <clears throat> so you open it up and it has just like orange tissue paper. Okay, so first thing that's right here on top is a Jeffree Star Cosmetics pop socket. It's in a like bright orange, basically the exact same color as the packaging. Okay, <clears throat> so, ooh, I was literally going to buy these. This is the uh, metal straw. So it's a reusable straw, and it comes with a cleaning brush apparently. I don't see a cleaning brush anywhere. But yeah, it's a metal straw in pink. It says it's the shade Strawberry. It says it has a cleaning brush, but I don't see that anywhere. So we're just going to leave that for now. What's next? This is a Velour Lip Scrub in Strawberry Gum. I have a couple of these. Um, not this flavor, though. I have the... Pancake and syrup one and then I have like the peach one. These are like honestly so good. I love these lip scrubs. Okay, so next we have a Velour lip, lip liner. I've not tried his lip liners. I was gonna order some but I just don't use lip liner very often. This is in the shade Allegedly. Let me just see. Okay, so it has like the crazy packaging and I'm just going to swatch this because I'm curious as to what the shade is. Okay, so it's kind of like a burnt kind of red color. Um, I don't know exactly how many liquid lipsticks I have that this will work for, but I'm sure I can find something. Okay. So, next we have a Supreme Frost highlighting. This is in the shade Hypothermia. Um, I, I did a review on these. I ordered the shade Wet Dreams, I believe. I will link it up in the iCards for you guys. <clears throat> so, it has like the pink rose gold packaging. And this one's really pretty. I don't think this is going to show up on camera. But it's like super iridescent. It kind of goes between like a bluish color and a pink color. Let me just swatch this. Okay, it's like super chunky glitter. I don't think it's gonna show up on camera at all, but it's right here and it kind of shifts like purpley. I don't think I'll get a ton of use out of that, but I mean, it's a really cute color. I might try it out, we'll see. <clears throat> I'm not a huge fan of the Supreme Frost. I prefer his, like, regular formula, but, yeah, like, I prefer the Skin Frost. So then we have a bunch of, like, four liquid lipsticks. So let's just start with this one here. Oh, this is the mystery shade. It has, like, the acid green packaging, and on the top is just a question mark. Hopefully you guys can see that. So let's just dig into this one first. So it has the acid green lid, which I love this packaging color. And it's like a really pinky color. 
let's just swatch this. It doesn't have a scent and it's like this really actually pretty <clears throat> kind of rosy pink color. Kind of reminds me a lot of the shade Rose Matter, which is one of my favorite Jeffree Star liquid lips. It's just like a super wearable pink color in my opinion. So I'm really excited with that one. I think that's like a really pretty color. Um, I don't think it's a color that you're going to absolutely need in your collection. So if you missed out on it, it's not the end of the world. So next we have the shade Diva. This is from the Jeffree Star like family collection. Uh, I already have this one, so I'm not going to like swatch it, but I'll open it and show you. It's like this really hot pink color. It's really pretty. I've worn it a couple times, but... Yeah, it's, it's a nice color. Next, we have the shade Mannequin. This is like one of his just traditional colors. It's a peachy kind of nude color. Um, I have this one too. I just bought it a couple months ago. It's a super nice wearable nude for like a lighter complexion. And last but not least, in the liquid lipsticks, we have the shade Poinsettia, which came in his... La latest Christmas collection, I think, holiday collection. It's like a metallic red. I will swatch this one. I'm not really a huge fan of metallic shades, but I do like this color. It's like a really pretty matte red. Matte red? It's a metallic red. Um, I think it's really pretty. <clears throat> I might wear it. Who knows? So, last but not least is a clothing item. So, <clears throat> I ordered this in a 3XL, but I think I'm going to give it to my roommate because she wants it. But, basically, it is just a black t-shirt that has the Jeffree Star logo on the side in like a neon yellow. I'm pretty sure that's all it's on here. Yeah, so it's I'm not going to unfold it. It's just going to... But <clears throat> basically, yeah, it just has the, like, the Jeffree Star logo here in neon yellow, which will be like over the breast area. So I think that's a really cute like basic shirt. Okay, <clears throat> so the t-shirt I like. I think I, I will wear it or my roommate will wear it, one or the other. The Supreme Frost, I'm, it's a beautiful color. I just don't think I'm going to get much use out of it. Maybe if I'm going to like a festival or something. The liquid lipstick is a very kind of orangey red color. So I don't know what I'm going to pair it with or the lip liner, sorry. It's a very orangey red color. Um, just don't really know what I'm going to wear it with, but I'm going to try and figure out a lipstick I can use it with. The lip scrub I'm definitely going to use, or I'll probably just like keep in my bathroom so I can like use it all the time. I'm super excited about the straw. I was going to buy these and I just didn't. The pop socket, um, I think it's like a little bit of a, like a whatever, like this is considered to be one of the 10 items, but I mean, they are cute. <clears throat> I'll probably use it. As for the lipsticks, um, I might use the shade Poinsettia, the like metallic red. Mannequin and Diva are both like really decent colors. Mannequin's like my, one of my go-to nude colors. Diva is a really hot pink that I like. I do already have those though, so I'm probably just going to give them to my roommate. And then the shade question mark, I think I'm definitely going to try this out and like wear it because it is a super muted rosy pink color. That's it for the $70 deluxe mystery box. Honestly, I was super hoping that I would get a eyeshadow palette, um, but that's fine. I'm definitely going to get some good use out of these products. And overall, I think it was worth it because I love... Jeffree Star Cosmetics makeup and everything like that, so to get a large value for it for like 
less than like basically you save like a hundred dollars which is I think a really good deal so yeah I'm probably gonna try and buy some more mystery boxes in the future hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please give it a big thumbs up and hit the subscribe button and I will see you all the next one bye guys